Okay, as, as I promised, I'm going to tell you this story of Google 42 Shades of Blue Links. Okay, so let me read it and show it to you here. Hey, Andrew, what's up? I want to show you guys this story here and read it to you. This is a split test, just to give you an idea how important split tests are. Okay. Um, if there is any company that truly lives to test everything ethos, it is Google, one of the more widely publicized and sometimes ridiculed examples of this involved testing various shades of blue links and ads across search and Gmail to determine which one site visitors uh, would be most likely to click on. Laugh all you want, but it turns out that the right shade of blue could be worth more than $200 million. According to Dan Copley, Google UK Managing Director, who explains. Okay, give me a second to go down. Okay, here we go. In the world of the hippo, which is usually the top person, paid person, I believe, in a corporation, uh, you ask the chief designer or the marketing director to pick a blue and he picks the solution, he or she picks the solution. In the world of data, you can run experiments to find the right answer. We ran 1% experiments showing 1% of users one blue, and another experiment showing 1% another blue. And actually, to make sure we covered all our bases, we ran 40 other experiments showing all the shades of blue you could possibly imagine and we saw this with shades of blue people like the most demonstrated by how much they clicked on them. As a result, we learned that a slightly purpler shade of blue was more conducive to clicking than a slightly greener shade of blue. And gee whiz, we made a decision. But the implication of that for us, given the scale of our business, was that we made an extra $200 million a year in ad revenue and keep in mind this is Gmail and Google and their AdSense and so forth their links so if you can imagine how many probably billions of times those links are being seen if you get that right blue the conversion rate on those two billion times just that little bit of shade of blue that's perfect that made a difference of 200 million dollars extra that's why the split test was worth refining because it was, it was worth so much. You can hire a lot more people at a company to try to figure that out, but typically you need the technology to figure that out for you. Um, hiring more people doesn't necessarily help. So that's why split testing is so important. It makes you a lot more money, and I'll catch you guys later.